Yeah, good day, if you was Mr. Sean Thompson poking along, not bad, thanks. Right, are you cheeky buggers? I'm gonna show you how to cook a damper. Can you see me? Oh, yes, the hair today. Yo, yo. Duff, you're gonna need to cook a damper. Shawnee's damper. You're gonna need a googleberry. Eh? Hey? Couple of them cheeky buggers. You're gonna need a bit of butter, a bit of Worcestershire shush. Bacon. Very important, the bacon. Some cheese, some salt, plain flour, and self raising flour above. Right, this is what you gotta do. Right, are you cheeky buggers? How's the camera angle? Mate, hey, I'm, geez, I'm professional. Cut a bit of your bacon off. Copy? Bit like that there, a bit more. Bit more for good luck. Always have one more for good luck. Put the bacon back in the freezer. Chop the bacon, like this. It is easier to cut bacon when it is frozen. The more random size the pieces, the better. You're gonna need that one random big one. Copy? Copy. Right, put bacon in bowl. Make as much mess as possible. Copy? Copy. Right, wipe your hands on your shirt. Copy? Copy. Use the plain flour first. Measure your plain flour out. Yeah, about that much. Self-raising flour. Measure your self-raising flour out. Yeah, about that much. Oh, that hurt. Get your spoon that you left on the gas stove and burn a little bit and mix it around a little bit in a minute. Butter, Alley brand, not the bad things. Copy? About that much. Salt, Himalayan pink salt I'm using today, viewers. About one agadaga, two agadaga, three agadaga, four agadaga, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen agadagas on your pink Himalayan salt. Copy? Eggleberry. One. Eggleberry. Two. Poke it for good luck. Carl's Tasty Cheese, mate. About that much. Some hot water out of the kettle, some I prepared earlier. Make sure it doesn't burn your fingies. Fingy taste test. Ow! About that much. Highly recommend to use a bowl that is too small so that it overflows when we're stirring with our burnt stirring stick. Copy? Copy. Start stirring, sort of, diligently, trying your hardest not to make mess so wifey does not stab you when you are sleeping. She beats me, you know. <laughs> you even watch my TikToks, wifey? You better watch my TikToks. Defend yourself. See, awesome, gluggy texture. Needs more burny hot water. Hot water test number two. A <laughs> little bit better. About that much. Let's all get them because the kettle's empty. Alrighty, lick test. <laughs> Best to cook it first. Again, wipe hands on shirt. Swill comes, crumbs into bowl. Waste not. Want not. <laughs> Continue to mix. Give good pat. Good damper. Clean up a little bit. Ready? Jeez, that was quick. Quickest clean up you guys have ever seen in your life. Get washishishishish shosh. About that much. Continue to stir. Washishishishish shosh. Add more pink Himalayan salt for good luck. Probably three agadagas. Agadaga, agadaga, agadaga. Continue to stir. <coughs> Couple of pats for good luck. Get lighter, light fire. Here's one I prepared earlier. Get bowl of damper, bring to camp oven. Use tailgate of Land Cruiser as workbench. Extremely handy. Scoop damper into camp oven. Scoop, scoop, scoop. Fight every urge that you have to lick the spoon. Spread damper evenly. Summon wifey to clean bowl. Wifey! Oh, get hit with shovel. Say goodbye to damper as you put lid on. See you, mate! Make awesome bed for camp oven with wifey hit stick. Put camp oven on bed. Make sure to tuck him in. I'm not even going to show you the end result. You'll have to cook it and find out yourself. Love you, mate.